if you are 20 to 30 years old, please find a good boss. Not, not necessarily a good company. Learn from the boss. Learn how to do it. When you are 30 to 40 years old, try to do something yourself if you really want to try. When you are 40 to 50 years old, do things that you are good at. After 20 years of learning, you should do something you're good at. When you are 50 to 60 years old, spend your time supporting young people. When you are six, over 60 years old, spend time with your grandchildren, right? That is normally a lot of people like that. So when you are graduate, when you just in the university, don't think about, I want to resign from the school and be another Bill Gates, because Bill Gates left Harvard. There's only one Bill Gates in the world. When you graduate, find a company. Most important, find a good boss that can train you, discipline you, and tell you what is good and right. It's more important than a good company, right? Of course, a good company, a good boss, even better. And then, continue your life. It's all about the partner. I'll just repeat the question so everyone Sorry, can I hear. Sorry, I did not catch it. Yeah. So, um, she said three weeks ago, Alibaba launched Tmall in Russia and is wondering what opportunities there are for people in the room to contribute to, to Alibaba's Tmall team. How will you and your team develop Tmall here in Russia? Thank you very much for this question. I think Tmall Russia is something that we are testing. Personally, my wish is that Timor Russia can inspire as many young people, as many entrepreneurs as possible. They can do the same thing. We not necessarily want to make Timor Russia big. I hope you understand my saying. Because we don't want Alibaba one day become the largest e-commerce company in Russia. This is, no, this is not my dream. This is not our dream. We want, by working on Timor Russia, a lot of know-how, a lot of experience, a lot of things we'll learn from Russian market can share with people so more young people in Russia start to do things on e-commerce. That is something that I really want to do. So we think that Alibaba, AliExpress is something we want to do a better job. AliExpress today is helping Chinese products or your, uh, Asia products to Russia. The purpose is what we want is helping Russian products to the world. This is what we want to do. So, we are very, very happy that we, I just, uh, before I came here, I, uh, I was having a lunch with our team in Moscow. We have about 100 colleagues here, and I said, in 10, 15 years, we must have 5,000 people in Russia. That means we need at least 4,900 people. This 5,000 people is not to do e-commerce because 5,000 people do e-commerce in Russia does not work. 5,000 people can support Russia SME to do e-commerce. 5,000 people can help logistic do better. 5,000 people can help payment better. 5,000 people can helping the SME promoting our products better. So this is our thinking. So many people keep on asking me, Jack, you know, you are coming here to conquer and occupy a whole Russia. You are going to take away a lot of our business. No, 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 this is not our purpose. We are not Amazon. We are Alibaba. I mean, I mean, does not mean we are better than Amazon. We just have a different business model. So we want to have more talents from Russia joining Alibaba. And we also have a lot of problems of translation for AliExpress, right? People say, have funny translations, which I'm sorry, I don't understand. But people say, it's great. 
we have a unique language capability. But I hope that I hope more and more young people in Russia getting jobs because of e-commerce infrastructure, finding jobs on the logistic. But not logistic does not mean delivered. Logistic is smart logistic based on data technology and payment. So this is something about how to join in Alibaba.